I'm David Saldran. In this edition of Power Ideas, we talk to Kevin Benning, Chief Operating Officer of City of Dreams Manila, about how the integrated resort has embarked on a campaign towards sustainability. You know, in a city known for having one of the world's most spectacular sunsets, City of Dreams Manila is the first integrated resort in the country to harness solar energy in equally spectacular fashion. So, hello there, Kevin. You know, if it wasn't for the pandemic, <laughs> I would have loved to see in person, physically, how City of Dreams Manila was able to transform the rooftops of your parking buildings to generate solar power. But I guess a virtual tour with you would be the best for now, right? Hi, David. Yes, it is. You know, welcome to the new normal. We're doing our best to make it work, and I cannot wait to take you on a personal tour of our rooftop when we go back to normal. All right, Kevin, I'm looking forward to that visit. In the meantime, let's talk about how City of Dreams Manila has made a conscious decision to reduce its carbon footprint with solar power being one of those initiatives. You currently have, I understand, 3,120 solar panels installed in the rooftops of two parking buildings, right? Now, that's the record for the largest installation in Metro Manila. The amount of power produced by these solar panels is enough to light up 12,000 homes for a year with an average monthly bill of 1,500 pesos. That is correct. The City of Dreams Manila is extremely proud to be the first integrated resort in the country to harness solar energy. You know, this project, we invested 76 million pesos and 1.2 megawatts of solar power into this property, maximizing our car park, as we mentioned. It's an extremely important step for us to achieve our goal for carbon neutrality and becoming a zero waste resort. You know, having a clean and renewable source of energy with no waste or emissions is just the right thing to do in our world moving forward. That sounds really fantastic, Kevin. Congratulations. But I want to know, what are we looking at in terms of savings in power costs? Well, we're looking at about 16 million pesos of energy savings per year. That equals about 20% of our hotel power consumption across our 940 rooms. But more than savings, we're looking at the larger picture. As an environmentally responsible business, we must do our share in the global movement to combat climate change. And we want to make a difference and fulfill our social responsibility. Why did you choose Medalco subsidiary, Spectrum, as your partner? I was asked this question quite a few times in December when we uh, launched this program and, and, and implemented our solar panels. And the answer is very simple. Spectrum provides the best solutions, services, and capabilities in the Philippines in regards to solar and energy saving solutions. You know, on top of that, with Spectrum being a subsidiary of Morocco, who is somebody we've worked extremely closely with since we started City of Dreams, we have a great level of trust in the long-term vision of Spectrum. And something I continue to share with everyone is the speed and efficiency of which this project came together. Now, it was only four months from start to finish when we partnered with Spectrum in July of 2019 to launch this fully in December of 2019. I, I've been working here for five years and I've yet to see a project come together as quickly and as well as this one did. I also understand, Kevin, there are other initiatives within your resort complex which are geared towards self-sufficiency, correct? All of which fall under your Sustainable Dreams program. So tell me more about this program of yours. As part of our overall sustainability strategy for medical resorts and entertainment across all of our properties in Asia and Europe, we launched uh, here in Manila the Sustainable Dreams program in 2018. And that's really focused on long-term sustainability initiatives across multiple channels. Wow, that's an amazing list of programs. And the best thing about it is, you know, these are all long-term programs with long-term effects. So whether there's a pandemic or not, Kevin, like those solar panels of yours, for example, they'll continue to generate power, whether there's a pandemic or not. You know what, as they say in your industry, the house always wins. But at City of Dreams Manila, looks like the environment wins as well. That's absolutely true, David. Thank you so much. And thank you so much as well. Kevin Benning, COO of City of Dreams Manila. Stay safe, Kevin. You as well. This is David Salgran for Power Ideas by Meralco.